Proverbs 8.31, my delight was with the sons of men. Every aspect of this planet is designed by God to bless you. So much so that Job asks, what is man that you should set your heart on him? God didn't place all the elements into a big jar and shake them. Proverbs 8 says he established the clouds, he strengthened the fountains, he assigned the sea its limit, and he rejoiced in the inhabited world because his delight is with the sons of men. Now, scientists admit all these facts, and they call them the anthropic principle, which is just a sciency name, meaning the universe is crafted for you to be alive. Oxygen is at the right level. If it was more, we'd have fires. If it was less, we'd suffocate. The atmosphere is transparent just right so that we get enough radiation to live but not die. And gravity can't be changed by 1 times 10 to the negative 38% or we die. The sun wouldn't exist and neither would you. On and on it goes. There's 120 very specific constants in creation that if you change them even by a degree, you guessed it, we die. And the probability of this happening? Well, if you took all the atoms in the universe and multiplied them by nine, blindfolded yourself, and then picked out the same atom twice in a row, you'd have better odds. Even renowned atheist Richard Dawkins says, biology is the study of complicated things that give the appearance of having been designed for a purpose. There's a purpose, Richard. It's because God delights in us.